there's a beautiful sunny afternoon here in Ireland and I think it's a great opportunity to have ourselves a little confession. Uh, this is my little confession. I am not an atheist. You may think that's a little bit bizarre considering the sort of videos I've been putting up so far and I therefore owe you an explanation. Because I'm not going to beat around the bush here. Uh, give me any god. Name your god. I do not believe in your God. And if I'm honest, if I look at the sort of things that I do or don't believe in, then atheism is by far the closest to my philosophical position in life. So why am I not an atheist? Let me explain. Let's start by calling myself an atheist. What's next? Maybe a nice little label pin? Would that be nice? Or maybe we'll organize ourselves, us atheists versus them, whoever they are. You see, that is where the problem is going. The moment I start calling myself an atheist, I have labeled myself. And as a result, I will be um, splitting the people around me in two camps. Those who are with me and those who are against me. And I'm not willing to do that. I am a rational human being and I think for myself. That's as far as I'm going to go. And atheism is the philosophy that suits me best. Fair enough. But don't call me an atheist. I will not call myself an atheist. I will not call you an atheist or not an atheist. Because if we look around us and we look at the organizations that people participate in, religious organizations, ideological organizations, they all have one underlying theme and that is the ability to split the world between us and them. And that is the reason, that's the underlying reason under all religion, ideology, communism, capitalism, you name it. That is the underlying reason why those sort of things are so dangerous. So anything that causes you to suspend your own ability to reason out things to think for yourself is bad, even if that thing is called atheism. So please, don't call me an atheist, even though the shoe fits. It is a little tight. Thank you.